everybody, and welcome to another episode of Crypto Marketing Insights. I'm Yasha Harari. Um, today, I just wanted to give you a quick update on one of the projects that I have been doing some marketing work on. As you know, I've been uh, working uh, with Ethlite Crypto for a while, and Ethlite Crypto is a crypto that is specifically designed and developed and deployed for the unbanked. Um, and it is a crypto that has a very, um, very limited market uh, cap uh, max supply. Um, it has only 10 million coins available as the max supply. Uh, for those of you who don't know, and it does have a wallet as well as obviously a cryptocurrency. Um, and uh, in addition to all those wonderful things, it, the Ethlite uh, crypto itself can be traded on ether flyer and on coinmax a couple of different exchanges uh, in addition to that there is some relatively big news uh, about f -like crypto on top of those big news and that is that f -like crypto is now also on uh, a website that tracks all the cryptos and you know it as coin market cap right that's the site that tracks all of the, um, I guess, what you call it, the market of crypto, uh, the, the, the legit coins or whatever you want to call them, the, the ones that are, you know, trackable, etc. There's thousands of them on here, obviously. Um, we're right new onto the site. And um, you can see right there, the Athlete Crypto page is on CoinMarketCap. If you just go to uh, CoinMarketCap and search for Athlete Crypto or search for the token name, which is at light T and uh, you'll see for yourself, you know, all the usual information and the charts and everything else you want to see. And uh, yeah, it's really great news. Why uh, do I think it's worthy of a, a little update? Well, when there's so many coins out there on coin market cap, well, first of all, obviously I market f -like Crypto, and this is a great achievement uh, for a small um, project that started out literally as a bootstrap project um, that has over time built a community of thousands and thousands and even tens of thousands um, of people who are actively involved or following or, you know, subscribed, etc. Um, it literally started from, you know, just being a brainchild of the founder um, to becoming a project that has now uh, achieved some level of legitimacy or authoritativeness or whatever you want to call it. Um, it is now you know, recognized as a crypto in the marketplace, you know, and trades for, trades for a respectable 20 or so cents per token. Um, considering how many other cryptos in the market exist and that this token has just listed a few days ago and is around the 2,000 out of 3,000 mark, so uh, not bad at all for a fresh start for a little technology um, project, a crypto project that had just launched on the world's major you know, crypto tracking service. Maybe you have some issue with, um, I don't know what, uh, any of the tracking services, but everybody knows CoinMarketCap is obviously the big one. So to be listed on there is terrific. It's a wonderful achievement. And to be honest, it just could not have been done without all the hard work and effort um, by all the members of the team, um, from the, uh, the social services, the social uh, media admins to the founder and CEO and everybody in between, uh, the technology folks, the design folks, uh, and even more than that, the community itself, which just cannot be overlooked or underscored enough. Um, the community of Athlete Crypto is a shining example of how uh, a community-centric crypto project, um, you know, that really cares about the opinions and inputs of its members, um, is you know able to succeed and achieve some pretty neat and great achievements, um, even at an early stage, um, just by, you know their contribution, their engagement, their constant, you know, uh, positive, constructive criticisms, their questions, um, all the good things they bring to the table. 
different opinions, different perspectives, and actually even uh, in some cases, you know, uh, literally contributions like graphics and, and other things that you know have act you know, have been have impacted the actual brand and things like that. So that is not to be overlooked at all. That is not to be diminished in any way because that is really the heart and soul of a project like F Light Crypto, which um, really does care very much um, about the people involved in the project, in the community, in the crypto. And the reason for that is very simple. I mean, it's not being built by uh, a massive uh, corporation that is heartless and soulless and doesn't care about you. Right. It's not we're not pretending to say that we are um, doing something that we're not. Um, we actually give weight to the things that matter to our community. Um, and all of that is, uh, you know, part of the plan of how we are developing this from the start. Um, if you look at the cryptocurrencies white paper itself, you can see that it's entirely designed to actually service the real world needs of the unbanked. And that's why we rolled out, for example, the wallet first, right? So if you go to the Ethlite uh, homepage, you can see, you know, check out the wallet, just go to ethlite.tech slash wallet. Um, and you can see, uh, you know, the wallet for your Android uh, device, if you have one, there's an iPhone one coming out uh, hopefully soon, I believe soon, according to our roadmap, and uh, we have so far stuck to our roadmap. So, um, yeah, that is really the, the short and sweet end of it, um, just to give you the quick update that Applight Crypto is on coin market cap, and what does this mean for Applight Crypto uh, in the future? Well, I mean, it doesn't change much, right? But what it means is that you can, first of all, easily find and track at like crypto and how it's doing on coin market cap, which is terrifically handy for a lot of people who use that site. And you can do all the things on that site that it offers, which is quite a lot. Um, in addition to that, um, F Light is moving ahead with other uh, plans uh, with other well, I don't want to give away too much here, but we are doing more of these kind of developments and other ones. Uh, so we are full steam ahead, pushing forward, and there are some exciting times ahead, I can assure you. Um, if you are familiar with f -like Crypto, fantastic. I'm glad you're on board, and I'm thrilled that you're uh, into this, and hopefully it's uh, good for you. If you have yet to look at FI Crypto, uh, well, and I can't give you financial advice and I wouldn't do it anyway, um, but uh, I definitely think that just from a curiosity point, the reason I say that is because there are billions of people in the world that are unbanked. And while some projects like Libra claim that they are going to service those unbanked people, the reality is they're not even going to go to those places where the unbanked actually live because they have been banned there. Athlete Crypto has not been banned anywhere and we are deployed already. It's already out there. The unbanked already use it. Now, in small quantity, etc., by relative proportions to the face of the earth and the global population, but it is out there, it is deployed, it is rolling out and it is growing growing and growing day by day right and that's how these things actually grow organically and properly um, if you're running any kind of small project whether it's you know your own whether it's your own crypto or there's some other project you're into um, this is a a simple example that you can look at <laughs> not so simple but a simple example it looks simple right that you could look at and say well okay well they did it you know, they built their airdrop, they built their white paper, they built their telegram, they built their all, you know, social networks, they did all that stuff, and they didn't have to spend a fortune to, uh, I mean, get it done. Obviously, it wasn't free, it took a lot of work, took a lot of effort, took a lot of resources, but it was done in such a way to minimize the bloat, to minimize the usual excesses and waste that you get from projects that are overfunded and, um, under brain powered, let's say, 
They take a lot of money and they waste it tremendously to discover something that they are convinced will work and then they still don't have a better shot than a project or a project that is built from the ground up intelligently um, without the wastefulness right so that is what we've done with that light so far i'm excited to see it reach this level and um, even more excited to see where it's going to go next because we have great plans for athlete crypto and i know the community uh, has been uh, excited as we have been to see these things starting to happen. So it's great to be able to deliver these things. I hope that anyone who's involved is, uh, you know, as glad as we are. I know that a lot of you have already said you are, but I hope the most of you, if not the all of you, are pleased with the developments we've made so far. And, uh, yeah, look forward to delivering more and if, of course, if anybody has any questions about FLI Crypto, hit me up here or on the Telegram. Um, you can also tweet at me if you should. Not hard to find. By all means, get in touch. And that's going to do it. Um, okay, so for now, thanks again for listening. And uh, until next time, folks, take care.